Hello everyone! Welcome back to Tech World. In today's tutorial episode, I'm going to show you how to log into Roadrunner email account. Keep watching the video till the end to learn how and subscribe to our channel by hitting the subscribe button and don't forget to press the bell icon so that YouTube will notify you whenever we post a new video. Roadrunner, now known as Spectrum, is used to market consumer and commercial cable televisions, internet, telephone and wireless services. Click open any web browser in order to log into your account. And once you do that, type in www.spectrum.net. Press the enter on your keyboard, and soon after you do that, you'll reach to the official website, which looks like this. In order to log into your email account, go and click on the sign in button. If you don't have an account yet, start with creating a username first. Fill in your information and register yourself to a new account first. Once you have an account, from the official website, click on the sign in button. Now, in order to get started, enter your username in the first text field. Make sure to enter a valid username you created during the sign-up process. Move on to the next text field and enter your password. If you want to double-check your password, then click on this I button and reveal your password in order to make sure it is typed in correct. In case you've forgotten your username and your password, you can simply go and click on Forgot Username or Password link at the bottom and follow the instructions in order to look for your username or to reset your password. After you are done with your password and username, if you want the system to remember your username, then leave the box as it is. But if you are using a public device or a shared device, make sure to uncheck this box. Now, confirm that you are not a robot by clicking on this box. After everything is done, click on the sign in button and you'll be logged in to your Roadrunner email account. That is how it is done. I hope the tutorial was helpful to you. If it was, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Feel free to comment down below in the comment box if you have a question or a feedback for us. I'll be back soon with more tutorial episodes again. Goodbye till then.